I refuse to just exist I'd rather shoot and miss So I'ma raise my fist And live it limitless Limitless Hey, so it's Sunday at 11pm And it's 6 o'clock in the morning tomorrow I'm catching a train to Toronto Where I'll be flying over to the UK For the British National Championships Um... It's the first time I've traveled since this whole pandemic began, uh, so a little bit of anxious feeling about traveling again, and a uh, pretty anxious feeling about uh, being in a competition again, but at the same time I'm pretty excited. So I'm about to pack my, my stuff here because I'm going to be over there for a week, um, and I made myself a list because if I don't, I know myself well enough to know that I'll forget something, probably something essential. And then I'll have to end up buying some stuff over there. So I'm gonna get my stuff packed here. I'm gonna pack up my luggage and my kit, and um, back to some sense of normalcy. Six AM as always. It's way too early. I'm at Union Station in Toronto. Plane leaves in about four and a half hours. So I'm just uh, on my way to take the up express. Pearson Airport. Well, I just got to the airport. Uh, not really sure what to expect with this check-in process here, so should be interesting. Okay, so I just checked in for my flight. That was, that was a ridiculous process. That passenger locator form thing. Oh my God, so many issues with it. But, uh, well, the most ridiculous check-in process that I've uh, probably experienced was followed up by the absolute easiest, most breeze of a security line ever. So that's a fair trade. boarding a plane again. First time in 20 months. Thank you. Have a good night.
landed in London. Uh, probably the most sleepless flight ever. But uh, yeah, here we are. And, uh, so much for adjusting my time zone. I guess I'm just gonna have to tough it out for the day. We still got buses and trains and stuff to catch, but here we go. So I can only imagine how long this uh, queue is going to be in passport control. I think this is the longest walk I've ever had from uh, the gate. To, uh, anything else so definitely the longest escalator All right, so I didn't record too much yesterday uh, after the travel chaos, I was completely exhausted. Uh, I got in and then I slept for three hours when I finally got in and then I went training and had about two and a half hours of training in, came back and I, I taught an online class from my club for my hotel room because of the time zone difference made it work out okay. But uh, all right, but yeah, I'm up about now. I'm just uh, trying to find a supermarket so I can get some just little odds and ends that I need. This is the hotel I'm staying in. It's really, really nice. But uh, yeah, I'm not really sure where I'm going. So thankfully, Google Maps is a wonderful app. It's gonna help me find this supermarket. And then uh, I'm gonna go training again. So get a little more kicking in. Hopefully I don't get hit by this van. And uh, very interesting like area this hotel's in. It almost looks like a country club. But it's a really, really beautiful area. Look at this, you know? Really nice. Anyways, catch you guys later. So I left my contact lenses case on the airplane. So yeah, it's been a bit of a weird, weird situation the last few days, but 
Uh, after looking around for somewhere to buy a case for about an hour and a half, I've arrived at the club again. And time for training. Right, so every time I'm here, there's this bread company that's got the same last name as me. So I'm meaning to try some of the products. So we're going to do an official review here of, of these rolls. So first I got nothing to, to heat it up with, so we're just going to have to put some peanut butter on that. Team GB official supplier of peanut butter. Hmm, pretty good. The natural peanut butter here spreads a lot better than the natural ones in Canada. Super soft, not just regular soft. Hmm, okay, okay. I can get down with that. No, yeah. that's good, man. That's a good roll. Thumbs up. I'm gonna start telling people that I'm related to whoever made that bread. <laughs> 